my dad was an amazing man. He was very strong, grew up on a farm, worked road construction, and as soon as my dad would get home from work, we'd, we'd come up here and there's, there's several places where we would always go in on horse rides. We'd tell me how to saddle a horse and spend a lot of time playing sports with him, being outdoors. When I was 14, I had a curveball thrown at me. My dad walks over and he, and he embraces me and he lets, he lets me know, he's like, hey, he's like, hey, Clark, I've, I've got cancer. You know, I'm 14, so fear, I mean, I, I was scared, I, I was. I can still relate to those feelings. I, I still look back today and I can remember how I felt and it still, it still brings back, it's like horror, <laughs> it's, it's scary. Um, yeah, but he, he was gone, gone. I mean, I knew he was never going to be there again. I knew I was never going to see him again in this life. He left me a legacy. He left me something to know of, you know, he gave me a map. This is how, this is how you need to live your life. It was by love and service and compassion. I want to be that way. I want to emulate him. How grateful I am to know that that man who embraced me and loved me taught me how to work and to play. I will see him again, and I will be with him again.